So today we will solve this building problem uh, for the midship compartment. So the question is given a box shaped vessel 40 meter long, 20 meter wide, 5 meter deep is floating in top water of RD 1.005 with drafts forward 3 meters and aft also 3 meters. Kg is given 4.2. If a midship compartment that is 15 meter long extending from side to side that is mean that means from port to starboard that is one compartment altogether with a permeability of 80% is bilged. Calculate GM after bilging. So for every bilging question, we need to first draw the diagram as I told you earlier. So we'll draw the diagram for this. So first we'll draw, draw a box shaped vessel. Then we'll make it like this. And then we'll draw the midship of this box shaped vessel. Then we'll draw the midship compartment that is like this. Now we will label it. Similar way you have to draw the diagrams in the exam. So draw the diagram first then you will come to know that what we need to do. This is midship compartment and this is how much deep. And also we need to draw the drop for this so this is the drop now we will label it so for labeling we know the total length is how much total length is 40 meters midship compartment is 15 meters and width is 20 meters the total depth is 5 meters and draft at which it is floating is 3.0 meters okay so this is the simple way we can draw the sketch and then we will write the values which is given that is l is equals to 40 meters b is equals to 20 meters d capital d is equals to 5 meters then draft small d is equals to 3.0 meters and kg is equals to 4.2 meters small l that is length of the compartment is 15 meters and permeability p is given 80 percent so later we will use it as 0.80 okay. and we what we need to find we need to find out the final gm only okay we don't need to find out the drafts in this question so generally if the question is extended further then they will ask you the forward and after final condition okay this we don't need to find out right now okay so for solving this question, in every building question, first we need to find out the sinkage. So first we'll find out the sinkage. Okay, so sinkage, you know, volume of lost buoyancy divided by your intact water plane area. This is total water plane area minus bilged water plane area. So in this question, lost buoyancy will be L into B into D into P okay divided by L into P minus so this is total and now bilge is L into P into P okay so small l is 15 this is 20 this is 3 this is 0 0.8 divided by 40 into 20 minus 15 into 20 into 0 0.8 then by solving this we will get 1.286 meters so this is a box you can make your own calculation the concept should be clear answers you can match later okay so sinkage we already found out now we need to find the new draft so new draft so new draft will be your original draft plus sinkage the original draft was 3.000 plus 1.286 that is your 4.286 meter is your new draft okay once you get the new draft you can calculate kb so it is a box shaped vessel it is a box shaped vessel as you know as you know this is a box shaped vessel so for the box shaped vessel if there is a midship compartment and it is getting pilched and you are filling something here so the draft is in case of the earlier draft was this now the draft was this but the water plane area will remain same because it is sinking bodily okay so for this question you have to find out also kb 
So KB will be equals to half of new draft. So that means half of 4.286 because it is box shaped vessel. Okay. So when you evaluate this, it will come around 2.143 meter. Okay. So this is your second step. You need to find out first sinkage, then KB. Now after finding out KB, your next aim is to find out BML. BML. So that will be equals to moment of inertia that is BMT I'm sorry BMT for midship compartment you have to find out BMT okay so that will be equals to your I in tech divided by the volume that will be original volume so I in tech as you know I in tech is your I whole area minus I of bilged area divided by volume okay. so for this I hole we need to find out so I hole will be equals to LB cube by 12 okay so LB cube now we don't have to shift anywhere because LC apply at the same place so LB cube is you know 40 into 20 cube divided by 12 and I bilged will be LB cube by 12 into now permeability because wherever the bilged portion is coming we need to multiply the permeability we will right now 15 is the length of the compartment multiply by 20 is the breadth 20 cube divided by 12 multiply by 0 0.80 so then we need to know volume volume will be equals to 40 into 20 into your original first volume that will be 3 well we will be using the draft 3 original draft So after doing this, so you should find out I intact. So you will place the values. So when you will place all the values, I am talking about these values, these three values, these three values. When you will enter in this formula, so you will get the value of I intact as 7. Point, I'm sorry, the value of BML as I'm sorry, BM. T, BMT transfer that is you will get 7.778 meters so this you should get by putting the values in the formula okay. once you get the BMT so you have now BMT you have KB so BMT 7.778 and KB you have how much KB we found out is 2.143 meters so you can get km km is equals to kb plus bmt kb is 2.143 plus bmt 7.778 okay so this is one equation you can say and then we need to solve for we need to finally uh, calculate gm so gm you know is km minus kg kg is given in the question that is kg is given in the question that is 4.2 meters so we can substitute the values 2.143 plus 7.778 minus 4.2 and this will give you this will give you 5.720 meters that is the value of final gm final gm okay so you should get this answer this is your answer so we'll solve the questions for advanced stability in the upcoming videos thank you very much for watching have a good day